A charge controller is really more like a regulator. If you think back of the older model cars, they didn't have alternators. They had generators, which would also have a regulator that would, once the batteries and electrical system in the car was completely satisfied, shut off the power from the generator because they didn't want to overcharge the battery. And that's what the charge controller is doing. So once you get your PV panels working, the energy produced can quickly exceed the charge capacity of the battery. The charge controller will stop feeding power to your batteries. Therefore, the charge controller is basically like a regulator that keeps your system in balance. And we'll show you how to hook it up, how to test it, and common problems in troubleshooting. Some charge controllers will also show you things like how much power your solar panel is producing and what voltage your battery is. We talked about the batteries a moment ago, and technological advances have provided us with some pretty impressive batteries. Currently, the best battery for solar and wind power systems is the deep cycle battery. And this is the battery that you want because you're going to charge it up during the day and offload it or discharge it during the night or when it's cloudy. Deep cycle batteries are needed when constant charging and discharging occurs. We'll also talk about different types of batteries, how to buy and hook up multiple batteries. It's important to know how to hook these multiple batteries because depending on how you have attached them, you're going to determine how much voltage and amperage you can put into your battery bank. And we'll show you how to verify if the batteries are working and once again common problems and troubleshooting. One of the things about solar panel systems is that they're very straightforward and simple to troubleshoot and to find out why they're not working. This is the first of several videos from Earth for Energy. Thank you for taking the time to watch this introduction. I'm sure you're going to have a lot of fun with your DIY project. It's exciting, rewarding and can save you a lot of money. Please watch the following videos as we get more involved in the different parts of your solar and wind power systems.